All right, a 5.32, a follow-up to the breaking news we first told you about. On Wavy News 10 at 11, the Coast Guard has spent the night searching for a man who disappeared after the canoe he was in capsized. That man was seen going under the water near the West Norfolk Bridge along Bayview Boulevard in Portsmouth. Two people in the canoe were able to swim to shore safely, but several water rescue teams have spent the rest of the night looking for one missing man. Ten of your signs, Katie Collette is at the scene this morning. Uh, Katie, how are, the, how are the search efforts now? Are they still going on, or has darkness kind of made them call it until they get daylight? light. Carrie, some of the crews have been pulled back, but you can see there's still a boat on the water here. The rescue mission is still underway. Although Lieutenant Jack Smith of the Coast Guard tells me they have recently switched out crews so they could make sure they have fresh eyes on the water. This is a joint effort between rescue crews of Portsmouth, Norfolk, the Coast Guard, and Virginia Marine Police. It's an effort many hope continues to be a rescue mission and not a recovery. Before rescue boats began skimming the water Tuesday night under the West Norfolk Bridge, before the Coast Guard launched their helicopter from Elizabeth City, there was this man. When I first came out here, there was a gentleman swimming up between the piers. I heard somebody screaming, help, help, help. Robert Wynn says he ran to the water's edge to see who was screaming. When I got down to the water, I seen him underneath the bridge, and he comes running up and says, there's two more, two more, two more of my buddies out in the water. Wynn ran to see if he could find a boat that could get to the overturned canoe in the water. Meanwhile, 911 was called, and the story of what happened became a bit more clear. The one that first guy to swim, he said, I, I was the only one that could swim real good, so he swam back. But he said the other two couldn't swim no, that good, and they were holding on to the boat. Rescue workers tell 10 on your side the canoe flipped over in the water just after 10 p.m. They say someone stood up in the boat, causing it to tip. A short time after, the first boater made it to shore. A second managed to make it as well, but the third is still out there. Yeah, but they're kind of distraught about their friend, which I don't blame them. I mean, I would be too. Now, many watch as the search for one man continues on the water. A search all want to end with a happy reunion. Just hoping, just hoping he makes it. Hoping and praying for them. Now we're back here live as you can see rescue crews continuing their search on the waters under the West Norfolk Bridge for that missing boater. Lieutenant Smith says the men were just out for a joyride last night and there were no life jackets on board. He says so far the search has turned up the canoe and a paddle but not the missing boater. Lieutenant Smith also tells me more crews will come out to the scene here at First Light and that also includes the helicopter. At First Light it will also return to take part in this search. Live in Portsmouth, Katie Collette, 10 on your side.